I, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So if you have recently been experiencing some random printing issues on Windows 11 and Windows 10, then just to let you know that you are not alone because Microsoft has officially confirmed yet another known issue for Windows 11 and Windows 10 over on its known issues health dashboard page to let us know that the printing issues may occur after the installation of the January 29, 2025 optional bug fix C release updates, also known as preview updates, or any later updates that Microsoft had released on those operating systems. And what is happening is that the affected printers may print random text and data automatically. So a bit of a strange bug, but um, just to post and quickly let you guys know in case you have been affected by any printer issues. Now, believe it or not, this issue is not affecting Windows 11 version 24H2. It's only affecting Windows 11 versions 22H2 and 23H2 and Windows 10 version 22H2. So for the first time in ages, 24H2 actually does not have this known issue. It's affecting the other versions of Windows 11 and Windows 10. Now, according to Microsoft, the printers that are affected are printers that support USB print and RPP, which stands for Internet Printing Protocol, over USB protocols. Those printers are affected, so just be aware of that. And they give us a little bit more information by saying it could also include network commands and unusual characters that are being printed over and above unexpectedly printing random text and data. And they say that this issue tends to occur more often when the printer is either powered on or reconnected to the device after being disconnected. And then the issue is observed when the printer driver is installed on the Windows device and the print spooler sends RPP protocol messages to the printer, causing it to print unexpected text. Now that's quite a mouthful, but at the end of the day, what you need to know is Microsoft say they have actually resolved the issue. They say the issue is mitigated using a known issue rollback, KRR for short, which is common. And just a quick recap as to what a known issue rollback is, a, is all about, in case you're unaware. Basically, it's an important Windows servicing improvement, which Microsoft says supports non-security bug fixes. So as mentioned, the C release updates that roll out near the end of the month, which enables Microsoft to revert a single targeted fix to a previously released update if a critical issue is discovered, as in this case, the printer issue. And it's nothing you have to do from your side. You don't have to download another update or anything like that. It's basically taking place um, under the hood and behind the scenes from Microsoft's side. And what I always suggest with a known issue rollback is because it can take up to 48 hours to be applied, if you want to quicken up and hurry up the process, restart your device. Don't shut it down. Restart. And that should um, hurry up the process if your device is affected um, using that KRR known issue rollback. And as mentioned, Microsoft says that the affected platforms are Windows 11, 23H2, Windows 11, 22H2, and Windows 10 version 22H2. 24H2 is not affected, believe it or not. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.